I am a zombie. How oh, I'm gonna walk across this clearing? Uh, who was that? That's it. That's a big metal. Oh God! It's a train! <laughs> Freeze frame. That, ladies and gentlemen, is the narration of what the zombie was thinking in this. No? Yeah. No. Yeah. Okay. I'll just move on. My name is Rage, and welcome to some more of the. I don't know what just happened there, but some more of the Walking Dead. Let us continue. You know what I love about recording these episodes, guys? Is I just love finding out what the next what the next instance of someone dying in an incredibly or easily avoidable way is. Seriously, the first person to die in this game in a way that actually I can see that they would die there, that's fair enough. I will have a moment of silence because thinking back through episode 1, 2, and so far in episode 3, cha chapter 3 even, there is literally no one who has died who actually had to die. Every single death has been utterly avoidable and completely retarded. And it's just, I love this game so much for that. It's fantastic. Then again, maybe people just become stupid in zombie apocalypses. What would I know? I've not been part of one, but I feel like I could do a better job than these morons. Alright. I'll, I'll find you in a minute as I just casually hold my gun in your face! She seems incredibly happy to say everyone she knows and loves is dead. Wait, that was a bit of a morbid intro. It's fine, though. I see Looks where like you're coming from. That, uh... That, um, uh... Wait, children. what? <laughs> Kenny! You so Kenny! So, Hate your you son. Uh, we should actually, um... Just what was left. We should There's actually put that sign outside. That seems they like would. a good way of... It, honestly, it seems like something they do. We're I would not put it past them. Ah, uh, bitch this probably still mad fun. that we slaughtered her father. Can when is she gonna this? get over that? It happened, like, the ages winter? ago. We'll what? Here. Some people I hold the worst grudges. I just... Ugh. My dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. We do whatever we, we have to do for the kids. <laughs> out of it to dry our laundry. We do whatever is best for the kids. Doesn't that make sense? It's suicide out there. No, it yeah, ain't, I bitch. Right. You do as you. you wow, well, no, it's like I was getting in character there. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, I take. It, I, I, apo I, <laughs> I apologize. I'm sorry. Uh, Somebody needs to make executive decisions. Stop their shit. Yeah, use your black powers, Lee. Everything can't come down to the same disagreement. A rat. Let us move out. Legit points here. Chew, chew out, chew out. Why did I? What? Where did I even get that from? Damn it! I'm not on anyone's side, Lily. These decisions affect everyone. Exactly. What about food situation. What about protection? Everyone about knows that Lee falls? should be the leader. Somebody he's the least retarded out of everyone. How is this not on a scale of one to retard, he's probably only need. a six. We've got plenty of food out of that station. What about medicine? What about medicine? We got plenty of food from that station wagon. Exactly. We want to take it. Where the hell would we be now? We can't just keep our fingers crossed for more station wagons. Ah. Uh, everything that happens to us. Seriously. Is for you to when a zombie apocalypse involves slow zombies, the worst thing that stops survivors it. is just you know arguments between themselves, not actually the zombies. It's the human conflict which allows the zombies to kill people. Some That's how it is in nearly all zombie alley, films. And dead, people, if it happened in real life, people just need to realize to that it is so easy store. to survive against slow zombies. It really, as long as you're not where it strikes, you are fine. Okay. You weren't out there. You guys couldn't try to save her. Don't take that tone with him. Don't take that tone with him. She was dead anyway. She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. Exactly. It's not so easy for him. Oh. Look, oh. Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. Kenny it's knows what's up. Earth. I mean, if it comes down to it, we can always use his son as bait as we leave the area. How would you Holy what shit! You know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Oh, can we please just lock her in a room Everybody and leave her? Clearly, out. clearly she's just not going to, uh... Just she's just a detriment to everyone in that. She'll get over it. She'll sure get over it. I mean, God, what is that problem? Up, otherwise, 
You understand, Ken. God. Right about one thing. None of this Ken, if only you didn't. If only Kenny didn't have his family or his wife. Wait, that counts as the first thing. He'd be such a better character. But no. Coming to a head. Yes, yes, they are. I think it would be better for everyone if we just well, either a fed her to zombies or b shot her. Maybe space. even c the bait option. The bait option tends Probably to work well in zombie situations. About what she was saying about missing supplies. Yeah, that is a good point, actually. Someone stealing, we probably is. should uh, probably deal with that. For everyone wondering, I am keeping up with the story. I have the ability to read and talk at the same time, strangely enough. Just in case you're all wondering. Y'all wondering? Wow, that was the m what? <laughs> Did everyone just see that? Walking up the stairs, oh, creepiest turnaround look you've ever seen. Followed by nothing in the carry on of the walking up the stairs. Open. Look at Lily's door. Okay, guys. All right. Let us see what conclusions Lee can make from looking at Lily's door. Here we go. It's Lily's room. Oh, it's Lily's room. Oh, Lily, you are. Oh my God, man. See, why? I can see why you're still alive, man. You are impeccable. Oh, fucking fantastic. <laughs> I love this game. I, I absolutely love it. Oh, not yet. I will. Alright. Good conversation up here so far. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot. But you do you. think, yeah, you are human. I think about you too. I think about you too. Oh. Oh. Our group is small. You're small. <laughs> what was that? Group is small. Yeah, well, you're small, so it's fine. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. What? Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. Okay. People need then to why? Because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone. But think about who you trust, and take the opportunity while you have it. So basically I've got to choose who I, uh, tell. It's a lifetime ago. You're probably right. I just want to see You're how people react right. when it's in. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. That is a good point. Let's go tell them how much I thing? murdered people. Thing is, I don't think he even, uh, I'll let, let people, people know. know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. Alright, this should be interesting. I'm gonna go tell Duck first and then threaten him. Oh! Don't call me small. <laughs> <sighs> now, is there anything else? I wonder who's gonna die it? this episode then. You think people were ready to hear about me? Do you feel safe here? You have any thoughts about Lily? Let's we'll go for the safe one. We know how we know how she feels about the other two things. Floor in a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know. That ain't happening, bitch. Fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. Sorry, sorry. I keep I keep slipping into character. It's not my fault, guys. Okay, it's not my I'm fault. Look into this thing. I'm gonna go Good look idea. into this thing. Good idea. All right. Let us do this, shears. Talk to Clement. Clementine, what's up? How are you doing? Those are some massive crayons that you guys seeing? That's like the size of her hand. What What's you doing you there, Clem? It's called a ah, can't help it, guys. Keep slipping in. showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. The botanical garden. Okay. She's still got a walkie-talkie as well. I swear to God, if Clementine dies at any point, that's just gonna be oh, GG. Really Literally the only character oh, worth saving. <sighs> do you like do it here? Like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? <laughs> <laughs> Clementine has had the best line in the entire game so far with the salt lick. Yeah, I guess I should tell Clementine, otherwise she might end up finding out from someone else and distrusting me. I need to talk to you for a second. Alright. The day you and I met, I was in a car accident. Yes. I remember. Your leg was bleeding. The car I was in was a police car. And I was on my way to jail for committing a crime. Don't react badly. Don't react badly. I need to tell you now, because I don't want you to hear it any other way. Okay. Do you have anything to say? I don't think so. You can uh, 
Go on back to your things. Yeah, see, that's the gentler way of saying it than straight up go going, Kid, I'm a murderer! Which was one of the options, apparently. Oh, got. Oh! It's Lily's room. It's still Lily's room! Alright, we got this, guys. We got this. I guess I should tell Kenny, because he pretty much trusts me now. Alright, guys, look at RV. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I believe it. Oh my god, he actually made something. Oh, oh my god. Yo, Ben, what's going on, man? Hey, Ben. What's up, Lee? What do you think, do you about, think Lily? about Lily? She scares the crap out of me. That's a wow, really? Thing to feel. You little I'm just bitch. She's going to snap. <laughs> when she snaps, she kills everyone. Talk now, I'm not telling this little kid. Bye. This kid. What, uh, that I'm a murderer. I'm gonna tell Kenny, I'm gonna tell Lily, and I'm gonna tell Clementine. And hopefully Duck, so I can threaten him. I need to find Duck. He must be somewhere. But where's Kenny? Oh, look, they've been drawing on the floor. Ah. Oh. Okay, Lee, Lee, please, can you... Can you... Lee, come on, man. Moonwalking. Moonwalking, because I'm so cool. The fuck was that? All right, where the hell is... Oh, there he is. All right, Kenny. Go. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. Why the hell not? It's we need the way to. It's gotta be. Ugh. But I'm not getting used to it. Well, you should be. You're American. How are you, Lee? No offense, guys, but you are a lamb to the teeth. Kenny, you got a second? Kenny, I don't want to tell his wife, but I'll tell Kenny. Need to tell you something. Sure, pal. What you got? All right, here we go. Now, if this ends up in a shootout, it's gonna be it well. It might actually be interesting. Oh no! What the she devil do to you? Shut up, man! I killed someone. I was on my way to prison three months ago. I was. Uh, See, I don't tell anyone straight up that I killed someone. I'll just tell them that I'm a criminal. No shit. No shit. <laughs> Good convo. It wasn't for touching kids, was it? Oh man, come on, man! <laughs> I, I gotta ask. No. Killed a guy in a fight. Wow, that's mm. some. Uh, Must have been a real piece of shit if you had to haul off and kill him. Oh, I'm okay. Straight there. Lee, oh. look at everything this mess has got us doing now. I'm sorry you went through whatever you went through. Oh. Yeah, we're straight. See, Kenny just is fine with it. I like that. Not gonna tell his wife. Not gonna tell the kid. I'll go tell Lily because it's just funny to piss her off. Uh, she's she's the comedy relief of the group in that everyone just likes to annoy her. All right, Lily, what's up? Turns out she's just a zombie. That would be very awkward for everyone involved. I'm sorry. Good, you, you better be sorry, you crazy, cr sorry character. <laughs> uh, following up about the stolen supplies. I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? But no, I wouldn't no, be asking you the question and you if I knew what was confess? going on. I'm not stealing shit. I came in here to help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. Who would it be? He or she or they have been taking things. He or she or they? For real who? What do you have to go on? For real? Who? What are you for got? real? Yes, See for what real. I mean, guys? It's I just inevitable. Shit. I just know. Lily. Who would it be? There's only like six people stuff. left. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. Hmm. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens. It just must be someone who wants the. Uh... So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. All right, we'll find things out. It's What's probably the kid. I don't know why I instantly accuse him. Oh. I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you're using it when you shouldn't. Okay, I'll poke okay. around. I'll poke around a little bit. There's no point uh, not mistrusting everyone in our group. That seems to be the anything? great way to I'm work together and get the job you. done. Oh, what? I can't tell her I'm a murderer? What? A mystery. Jesus Christ. Punch it! Dog. Punch it, Lee! Put! Oh God, it's Duck. Oh, sorry. I thought he was a um, hideous monster talking. from the depths of hell. You need to unhear. Wait, does the same thing? Ah, oh, silly me. No, what you can't I help. You what I just say? And I can be Dick Grayson. You're you can be. You, you're certainly a dick, but the, we can forget the Grayson part. Know who it is? 
No, if you tell anybody, there will be trouble. Fine, you're Robin. You can't help. And if you tell anybody, it will be trouble. A whole threat. See, See I told you I wanted to threaten Doug. And it actually let me threaten him. Tell us so. Oh the my god. Not helping? You can't help. I will live in the shadows. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so happy. That's just made my day. Alright, let us go find out who it is that's being a uh, little bitch. I bet it's, uh, I bet I know who it is. See what- The flashlight was broken. Was it you? No. You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous and maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried and tossed it. What's with the third degree? I didn't break any flashlight. Okay mm. then. Maybe he didn't. Interesting. Alright. What about these two? Alright, did you, you guys break it? know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. Well then, I let's figure out who did it. Over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot though. Oh, well done. Oh, I'm gonna uh, clean up this glass that's gonna cut up all the kids. Ah, I forgot to do it though. Probably gonna be fine. Uh, you know, I just love the commentary of this group. It's absolutely phenomenal. Da, 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 da. All right, let's see if Callie knows. I talked to Kenny. Talk to Kenny about who I am. And? He was cool. He just worries about his family. That wasn't so hard, was it, tough guy? I talked, talked to Clementine. To Clementine about things. How'd she handle it? I don't know. She's tough to read. She adores you. Don't worry. Do you know anything about this flashlight? Do you think I should do tell everyone? Is that what flashlight? I need to do? Or? It's broken. I know it's broken. <laughs> the batteries might be in backwards. <sighs> it uses just one. Everything should. What was the question? <laughs> Did you break the flashlight? No. Okay. I love the conversations these uh, these two have. That's brilliant. I think I might just have to put another survivor on my list of people that actually need to not die. So that brings it up to two. <laughs> I'll talk to you later. Talk to you later. All right. So it wasn't Carly. It wasn't those two. Clementine. Clementine, what you been up to? Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. What like a what? dick. Putting a bug on his pillow? Did you do that? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Oh, what a legend. I swear to God if anything happens to Clementine. That was... Oh, just it was funny and it involved tormenting Duck. I mean, brilliant. Look at gate. Are you going to tell me it's a gate, Lee? Come on, you know. Oh, we didn't even get any information. We just stared outside for a bit. That is a new level of detective work. Uh, right, so we need to find... Are we really down to, like, six survivors? Jesus Christ. Well, then who could it be? I've talked to everyone. Where's Duck, actually? That's a good point. Hmm, I'll go talk to Lily again. I don't really know what I'm doing. Let's go. Hey. Find anything? I haven't found anything haven't yet. Found out anything well, there's yet. nothing to find in here. Ask around. Jesus, investigate. I've talked okay, to literally okay. everyone who's still alive. I need to tell you something. What is it? I was sent to prison before the plague. You think that's news? I guess I hoped it was. <laughs> Worse. Did you think that story died with my dad? Anything else? No. Oh, good. Well, that saved another awkward uh, exchange. That doesn't answer the flashlight question. I'm a little bit confuzzled right now. I mean, I did say uh, Lee is like the worst detective in the world, so maybe that's what's happening. If I talk to someone... Hi, guys. You need to try out of it. Gadget, can I talk to you a second? About the guns. About the guns. Don't you start. Okay. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but we need them. There's no doubt about that. Uh, should I talk?
tell, can't you? I'll go I'll see what, what uh, thing he's saying now. I really, like, I've talked to everyone. How can, how can this be? Talk to Ben? Let's talk to him again. No, talk he's got later, nothing. Ben. Bye. Basically, I walked up to him, didn't say anything, and went, talk to you later. So that was a, uh, overall competent conversation that we had going on there. Do we have to go up the stairs? Yes, we do. So why is there also a go up the stairs option if, you know, right, I told Lily. Lily. You were right. She and Larry spoke, obviously. It went about as well as you would expect. Well, that was good. I love one-sided conversations. I seriously don't know who to uh, talk to about this flashlight, then. Interest. Very, very interest. Like, I want to know where Duck is. I genuinely believe it was Duck. It's just... Look at Hopscotch. Square... Glass over here, sir. There's some broken glass on the ground there. Can I go have a look around here? Is there anything going on? Nope. Inspect broken glass. Hmm. Alright, good. We've confirmed that, at least. We're, uh... Oh, good. We can actually make some progress. Sweet. Look at Jog X. There's something drawn there. I'll have to find out there's something drawn there before I'm allowed to ex inspect it. Pink. Hmm. Duck. <laughs> Clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? I thought I told you you couldn't help. I'm curious. Oh, let me punch this child. Maybe it's a sign. Well, obviously it's a sign. It could be. Clearly it's, it's letting shocked. someone know. It's weird. Okay, back to investigating. Ugh. Uh, I guess we're going to have to go talk to uh, Clementine again. Certainly interesting, anyway. Do we even have any pink chalk? Clearly someone's been stealing and uh, make marking that X to have let people know. Ah, uh, yes. Clementine loves to draw with it. Yeah, of course. I'll talk to her. Good. Thanks for that. So happy. You know, I thought they might have some insight, I thought they might have something going on, but no. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do, uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. <laughs> Lee. What, duck? I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Ooh. Really? Totally. <laughs> I was coming to see him for clues. Yeah, and... Duck, I got it. Good job. Oh. Interesting. I'm not high fiving you, Duck. Fuck off. Look at the uh, chalk oh, scruff. Chalk. Yeah, thank. Why is that even an option? Oh! Somebody was over here, too. Hmm. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. Can't believe he expected me to give him a high five. Although I can, uh... You didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No. Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. I wonder why. That's probably for the best. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Lee knows where it's at. Alright. So I'm gonna go out the gate. Which is probably dangerous, seeing as that zombie veil, but... what? You know, we need to find the, the uh, mystery of the missing pink chalk. Who the fuck cares about safety? Ugh. <sighs> Alright, so I can't leave the road. I don't care about the fence, it's just going to tell me it's a fence. Alright, great. There's a great down there. Oh, thanks, man. Look at great. There's a great down there! <laughs> I think we found our missing supplies. Oh, really? You just didn't automatically pick. Clearly, that's what I do next. Game. Son of a bitch. Alright, so we found the, uh,. Missing stuff. Alright, guys, that'll Not do for today's episode. I came up with this. As that was a loading point. A meds in it. My name has been uh, Rage. This has been Walking and Dead. Please like, favorite, mm -hmm. and share. And I'd love to know your yeah. favorite retardation from today's. That should be a theme, everybody honestly. Everybody. Okay. 
My name. I've already said that. Yeah, I'll see you next time. A good bye. Is on fire. Minecraft gotta do anything you want it to. English failure! Like and subscribe! I can fly!